come over to the cup and eat one of these sleeky, slimy worms. Yeah. <laughs> one, two, three. Woo! Now I'm gonna show you the outside. And we have this huge backyard. Everybody give Grandma and Grandpa a big hug. Please hug! Hugs, hugs! Cause we got all the time in the world For better or worse We should stay together So let's stay young and in love We should focus on us Forever Yeah baby if you and welcome to the vlog today. As you can see, we are in a different place now. And yesterday we were just traveling, we went to dinner, we unpacked, didn't really vlog much yesterday, but we are in a new house now. It's bigger than the last one, has two pools, future house tour coming your way. Right now we're gonna do a survivor challenge with the kiddos, so I'm gonna take you along with me. Now my kiddos definitely have a little bit of an advantage because if you haven't checked out that vlog, go check it out where we did the Survivor Challenge. There's Ty. Hi. We're gonna do it with all the cousins, just upstairs where it's a little bit cooler. It's 110 degrees today, so super hot. Livy, come do a Survivor Challenge. I'm up here. Livy, doing the Survivor Challenge? Yeah. All right, survivors ready? Yes. This is what you will be expected to do. You will run up the stairs, starting at the bottom. You will grab the blue ball and shoot it into the basket. You cannot move on until you make it. You will then crawl through the cones on your hands and knees without knocking them over. You will then be thrown a ball from someone right here, Amy. <laughs> And then spin, hula hoop five times. What should we do? Five. And come over to the cup and eat one of these sleeky, slimy worms. Yeah. <laughs> you will then build a tower of cups. Then climb under the table on your hands and knees and answer a trivia question. What puts Snow White into a deep, deep sleep? A poison apple? You got it. Correct! And then the timer will stop. Yeah. Survivors ready? Yeah. First up is Brooks. Brooks, how old are you? Two. He is two. You got it, buddy. Knuckles. Good luck, Survivor. Good job!
Survivor ready? ready? Yeah. In three, two, one, go! Nice. Go, 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 go. Force located. California. Got it. Gather round. Let's see who won. Third place winner with a score of 35 seconds. Oh, Hallie Gomez. Hallie. Woohoo. Hallie, you got the best fruit letters. Yeah, Hallie. In second place with a score of 33 me, seconds. Me, me, me. Victor Stevens. In first place with a score of 30. One second, uh, Ty Gomez. Uh, Ty, way to go! Woohoo! We've been prepping for this. <laughs> Just kidding. Marcos is off golfing. The girls are gonna go ahead to lunch and pedicures. Kids are gonna swim this afternoon, and then we gotta get ready for family pictures. We're doing a huge group of family pictures with everyone in the family. There's 32 of us, so that should be interesting. So we'll just take you along with us, whatever we do today. We'll show you the house tour right now. This is where we're staying. There's two rooms right here. They look the exact same. This is the front door where I walked in, so I've just done a little loop around there. Two more bedrooms right here, and a bathroom. Just goes to the garage and back to the kitchen. these bunk beds for the kiddos and you come up these stairs and there's a third floor tons of beds for all the kids all the cousins can sleep together now I'm going to show you the outside So we've got an indoor pool right here we have not used yet tons of tables and chairs and we have this huge backyard Guys, 
that concludes the house tour. It's huge. I think it sleeps up to 52 people, but super fun house. We're gonna be here for the next three days and then we're heading home. So we're just gonna give you a little snippets here and there of what we do the next three days. It's gonna be more chill, swimming, playing games, chilling, but we'll take you along with us the best that we can. I'm gonna hand the camera over to Marcos. He's gonna take care of the kids since I've had them all morning while he's been golfing and go swimming and stuff. I totally dropped the ball and got a little bit frazzled and didn't vlog us going to family pictures, but here we are already. Hallie looks pretty in her mint. Marcos looks awesome in his purple. <laughs> I'm in my light blue, but Marcos was taking some pictures in the background, so I will insert those right now. It was super great. It went good. I mean, 32 people, you can only expect so much, but Everyone looked really good in their light colors, so I'll insert those pictures right now, and we will catch you guys tomorrow. I can see what we are, don't know where we belong. Wanna know what you're saying? Grandma shark, do 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 do. Grandma shark. Everybody, give Grandma and Grandpa a big hug. Uh, give me a higher basis. Want you to feel my pages? Is this for real or is it just a fantasy? Are we from now or? Really meant to be Are you still in my arms When we've read out all the parts Of this story For past the epilogue Will I still be in your heart In this story Are you still in my arms When we've read out all the parts Of this story For past the epilogue Will I still be should my heart skip a beat? Wanna feel something deep? Do I really need your saving? You're the one on time I've wasted. Now the story is new, just a chapter or two. Will it be the same at the end? Don't want it to finish at the end. Is this for real or is it just a fantasy? Are we from now or is it really meant to be? Still in my arms when we've read out all the parts of this story. Far past the epilogue, will I still be in your heart in this story?